How cool are those boots? I want them. <laughs> I don't have $440. I like those boots. Wouldn't it be nice to be rich? <laughs> Happy horses. Yeah. All right, time to go to the osteo. Save my life, osteo. All right, just got back from the osteo. Then I went shopping. I got the new Tony Jordan book. I got this because it's got a Dalla Hest on it and I love all things Swedish. So I was like, I don't care what it's about. If it's Swedish, I'm going to read it. I've got Jane Harper's book, The Drive. Which is the one she's most famous for, but I haven't actually read it yet. I don't know if it's actually about a horse. I think it's more about the artwork, but I thought, why not? She's a pretty good author. <laughs> I'll take the whole thing. All right. I'm going to be honest. Today, I was just lazy. <laughs> I got so into writing that it got to 4 30 and i was like oh i was going to go ride and then my partner got home from work and we got talking and we sat on the couch together and then i'm like oh it's 5 30. oh well look guys that's it tomorrow i am writing tomorrow i am writing i promise I promise because oh, I'm getting mad at myself at this point and it's like oh it makes it so much worse when I'm doing these vlogs so I'm like oh I didn't ride again I didn't ride I didn't ride yeah I'm sorry but tomorrow I'm going to get up early be out here at 7 7 7 30 I'm gonna ride move I'm going to feed them Put their rugs on because I came down with my niece before as you would have seen. Well, that's the thing, like straight after I spoke to you, my family came over, so it was like, oh well. Okay, and then I got into writing once they left. That was why I didn't write <laughs> as well. I just got so distracted, so into what I'm writing. Oh well. Tomorrow. I'm gonna do it tomorrow. something oh poor momo don't try to come under the fence i'll come under the fence <laughs> good night papa i love you oh the hungry boy today anyway guys that's tuesday and i'll see you bright and early in the morning promise <laughs> well we're on <laughs> we're a bit spooky today I'm gonna have to kick <laughs> Gosh, me. Today it's Moo that's throwing a fit about silly things. Alright, we were a very spooky boy today. But that's okay. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> Just look at his face. He's like, I am not with it today. I am not a happy pony today. You rode me. Um, but he was spooky when I when I got him out today. So, sorry, I just got to do this to sort of remind him because otherwise he's going to get bargy because he's nervous. <sighs> he's not usually bargy, just when he's nervous. Because <laughs> he's a mummy's boy and he creeps in to say, protect me. Yeah, he came out pretty spooky. So, I was like, well, that's just him today, that's fine. It's not like anything in particular set him off. We've got some plovers going around, yapping away. So he was a bit bothered by that. He was a bit bothered by a mouse or a rat. Baby. <laughs> you are a total baby. Hello team! Happy Thursday! Today was a very busy day with my other job, getting things done. Today I'm going to just groom the horses because they've had 
a naked day. Look how clear the sky is, guys. It's just gorgeous. So they're going to be covered in mud. So I thought today I will just give them a good groom before I put their rugs back on. All right, here I am with Holly. We're gonna do a before and after. <laughs> Some mud here. Some mud here. <laughs> Holly, what do you have to say for yourself? Just gonna brush, brush, brush. Okay, Holly's ready for her after. After a five minute brush. We're still a bit dirty. But we no longer are covered in mud. There's some mud still on her tail, but that's okay. Hey. Yes. We are a dirty boy. <laughs> Slightly suspicious, but he is muddy. And considering I brushed him off yesterday, and this is all from today, I think you win the prize for the rot, Mr. Moo. Yes. All right, final result. <laughs> Someone's telling me he's hungry. <laughs> Oh, you're so beautiful, Moo! He went, yeah, actually, that felt really good. <laughs> Babies. Aww. Hello, team. It's Friday. And that means that it's Farrier Day. Farrier is going to come and do Moo's feet and take off all his shoes. Fingers crossed she'll be okay. And Treating what he was doing? Yeah. Pretty hard to insult Cobber. Well, you're a good boy. <laughs> the neighbours have just let their dogs out, so they're looking over there, but we're done. We're just going to cool off. We only had two spooks today, so an improvement. Right? An improvement, Baba! It's like, oh my god, the dogs are out! Well, they're barking anyway. So yeah, we're gonna cool off and then that's it, we're done. He was a good boy. We did lots of leg yield today. Oh, the right canter felt amazing. I was listening to some country music as I was cantering around. And it was like, okay, I've got my love of riding back right now. I think that's what I've missed, guys, just enjoying it. I'm on the buffer wall. Don't take off. We're gonna put the phone down. <laughs> Spooky horses, man. <laughs> Cheeky boy. Are you stay and walk until she accepts the new length of rain without Yeah. Yeah. Exactly, but this is so normal, right? Like, so they don't forget. Oh, up there. So your job is to correct her rhythm before it's a problem. Like there, touch there. Little left rein, because she's swinging quarters. Good. That's the trot I want. Good girl. Play massage that Play-Doh. Soften. Good. A little touch with the leg there. Nice rhythm before it gets too slow the less she's going to shoot off like that to find it because that in-between trot is difficult and that's why it's like oh I'm going to either flatten and run good girl leg there or I'm going to come back and do nothing so you just go this is my trot no less that's it no less okay so we're going to go so bump 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 good that's trot, bump, 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 bump. Yeah, Amy. Yeah. 
Absolutely we can, and then you can walk. Good girl. Lesson learnt from my lesson today. Get out of your head. Just give it a go and be kind to yourself and forgive yourself. Lessons in how to feel when you've lost your confidence. Com when you've lost your confidence, get out of your head and be patient with yourself. Good morning team. Happy Sunday, last day of the week. Turn. Look at you. You were such a good girl. I didn't film any of me actually working because added pressure. So, yeah, I think we've done well this week. Even though we didn't do anything all week, really. But we had a ride yesterday and she's been so good today. So, thanks for tuning in and I'll see you next week. Bye.